Shaila! 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 La viola, la viola, errada. Me prania, me prania, me prania. Vaila, 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 vaila. Isabela, vaila, vaila, vaila. Hemiala, hemiala, hemiala. I have raised an altar. This is my first time of doing such a thing in the history of my ministry. This may never be repeated again in my lifetime. It's a once-off instruction from the Lord. Each suit on this ground I've used to labor on this altar. I've lamented and prayed. The sweat is still there. It, it was kept and preserved. It has not gone to laundry. All the prayers you see on the Facebook, Mahila! lamenting and tearing, these are the suits. They carry mantles. Altars have been raised. we cross over to the other side you will not go out you will not go to the other side with the embargo of your past with the embargoes of your family threats you will enter with glory you will enter with life you will enter with testimonies you will enter with prosperity you will enter with healing you will enter with deliverance you will enter with testimonies in the name of Jesus the Christ When you came out of Egypt and crossed the Red Sea, you came against the Goliaths of your self. Every crossing over brings you, presents unto you a warfare. Crossing over Jordan does not mean you have arrived. In fact, crossing Jordan is a crossing over to fight with demons. The warfare of the wilderness is the demon of you. You're fighting yourself. You're fighting your strive, your guilt, your anger, your doubts, your shortcomings, your depression, your unwillingness to pray. You're falling in and out of holiness. So you will remain in the wilderness until you overcome yourself. I don't know who I am speaking to tonight or this morning, but the Lord says the hour has come. The waiting season is over. Unfortunately, the season has come. Ah, Jordan is splitting into two right now. The willing and the ready, the broken and the yielded will cross through the river of God and they shall qualify to confront the demons that are within the walls of Jericho and in the walls of Jericho there are powers of darkness the rulers of dimensions that belong to humanity we are about to dethrone forces of darkness that have ruled over the atmosphere over the years so by the time we come out of Jordan and cross over Jordan we will confront the forces of darkness in the atmosphere 
Yes, it was my first time uh, of experiencing such power. Even now, I'm still shaking. Um, it was awesome. It was just a great experience. I want to thank Papa for this, and I believe that I've crossed the, the river of Jordan. I've experienced as I crossed over. It's like something, it's like a whirlwind around me, and I can still feel it, and I know I'm not the same. I can't explain what happened, but I just know everything that was attached to my bloodline, divorce, depression, everything that I've experienced is just gone because I, it's like I don't feel myself, the old me is just gone. Today's service was so powerful. I mean, I can feel a change. I can feel like I left something behind. This morning we had a crossing over the Jordan in the spirit. And it's something unique, it's something uncommon, it's something, it's a mystery. And I can say that, you know, that we have really crossed over. And we have stepped out of our wilderness. And we have the walls of Jericho is falling down. And I must say that this is something awesome. I'm just overwhelmed this morning. Because when I walked over before I could, when I lifted this right leg of mine, as the man of God took my hand, there was electricity that went through me. I'm still shivering now as there's so much shaking in my body. And um, my leg is perfect, I can lift him. My ankle, I'm moving. I want to say thank you, Papa. Thank you, Mama. Thank you, Abba Father.